Now, the government, through the Microfinance Support Centre, has launched a new programme aimed at engaging faith-based organisations in the Wealth Creation Initiative to eradicate poverty at household level in both rural and urban centres. In a stakeholders' engagement meeting organised by the Microfinance Support Centre in Kampala Nile Resort, the Minister of State for Microfinance, Haruna Kasolo, highlighted the role of religious institutions in poverty alleviation as we hear more the microfinance support center has initiated a household poverty eradication program that will be spearheaded by faith-based organizations in greater mukono in a stakeholder engagement convention at Kampala Nai Resort, the Minister of State for Microfinance, Haruna Kasoro, explained that the government is involving religious institutions in the fight against poverty due to their ability to effectively disseminate wealth creation information to the masses. So I want to encourage all of you now this program which I am about to launch, it should change the people within the diocese, the lives of the people within the diocese. Minister Kasolo highlighted the government Pigari initiative targeting Christian-based organizations is to be implemented by Mukono Diocese. He explained that Pigari was chosen because it is market-oriented and has the potential to lift many rural and urban communities out of poverty. The market. The market. We must support Mukono then Wakiso, Kampala and other cities and we have the money. The meeting held to gather views on the project's implementation focused on communities in the districts of Mokono, Kayunga and Buikwe. Retired Bishop of Mokono Diocese William Sebagara emphasized that Pigari is the best option among other enterprises to combat poverty in many households. We, we are organizing groups between five to seven groups, uh, seven people, five to seven people in a group so that they could support one another. And those ones we, are, we began by giving them free animals for them to rear. And so these groups would actually, we are expecting up to grow up because as they bring back, we also form other groups. We had formed so many groups and we had over a thousand people who had actually uh, formed up the groups in order to have the program roll out. The minister also tasked the microfinance support center with designing a special program for Muslim communities in Greater Mukono and Aj resident district commissioners and chief executive officers to disseminate wealth creation information to the public. Sudat Kaye and Robert Waiter, UBC News.